Yo 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 what's up it's your boy Tube Skills or so do so so well. Today we will be doing my first ever my first ever rebuild on 2020 I'm pretty sure it is. Wigan got relegated yesterday via the last game for, by a point deduction, twelve points. I'm gonna take it to the Champions League final and win it. This is a squad, I think a new right back, a new RM and a new LM is gonna be what I need. Because my keeper, the centre back, he's a youngster, so I'm going to keep him and not get another centre back unless there's one for a bargain. QPR accepted 4.1 mil for their RM. Well, I'm not even going to try and pronounce the name of, but he's very quick. He's, he's only 21, so he has a lot of potential ahead of him. This is going to be a banging of a signing for this League 1 team. 750 grand for the 31 year old striker I had to sell him and I didn't really care how much he got for him I just wanted him out because of his age and he isn't our main striker so I could probably bring someone some way or form of decent in. I'm going to look at a new right back because my midfield's done or a new centre back but I do have that youngster to that will get his potential a lot higher or his overall his potential has to be a good one anyway I'm going to see you if I make a new sign sell someone or second off halfway through the season we are first Charlton Athletic is second Hull City are fourth and that's a big that's a big blow for Hull right there anyway I'm going to see you at the end of the season or if I do any more chance I we are in the championship next season with 117 points in league one to send us up. One loss, we nearly went undefeated. Charlton have gone up. Hull City finished fourth below Portsmouth, that's a surprise. Well it all knocked us out of the losing dot controversy. Alright, we've got knocked out in semis to Bristol Rovers. Hull vs Portsmouth to go up. I'm gonna say Portsmouth will beat him to go up. I don't. Season 2 is here and I'm going to be looking at a new goalkeeper and a new centre back because they're the two weakest spots on the team right now. I'll see you when I get the transfers done. I have to thank Burnley for making me only spend 2.6 million on a goalkeeper. I'm going to have to spend about 4.6, maybe 4.7 mil on Daniel Fry as a new centre back. But this goalkeeper is a beast. 71 overall, 23. Dale Fry is a new signing for us. 4.66 million pounds. And it's, gonna be, it's definitely money well spent since I've, I've, I forgot to record the thing that showed out. Not a bad 27 games. 46 points, 8th place. Norwich, Sheffield, Burnley, Brentford, Stoke and Nottingham Forest are in the top six. In a way, bottom six are Coventry, Luton, QPR, Portsmouth, Sheffield, Wednesday, Birmingham and Charlton Athletic. Let's go. The new addition to our team is a midfielder aged 22 years old and he's from Huddersfield. He's a good player. I've had him on my Wednesday career mode. I know we will do bits, especially once he hits his full potential. Wait, let's get to the end of Sheffield United won the championship. Burnley came second, ninth third, Brentford fourth, fifth was Stoke, sixth was Nottingham, seventh was us. Two points behind. Uh, Portsmouth, Luton and Coventry got relegated after the Prince getting hammered all season Co Coventry. Knights be Brentford 1-0 to go up to the Prem. Uh, not in the first host to Norwich, so haha, not in you to cast. Season 3 is here, and I've started off with a banging of a sign of 4.7 mil for Joel Asaro. Striker, he wants, he says if he scores 20 goals, I'll give him 3 and 6 grand. I accepted it because that would deserve something. I mean, I'll see you halfway through season. Halfway through the season, we are fourth. West Brom and Brentford topping it. We're six points behind Stoke. We are seven points behind Automatics. Uh, Barnsley, Swansea, and Charlton of Wands and Relegation right now. 
but it's so tight the bottom of it. Just goal difference is splint. Right. For a team to finish over 100 points, four teams to have fi five teams to have finished over 100 points and not go up in automatic. This game is bullshit for that. How many horses did we have? Three. And the way those with QPR and Swansea have all got relegated, and Swansea did beat us during the season. How did we do in the playoffs? Is my question. Did we do good? Did we do bad? <gasps> Wait, we're in Prem. I've just got. I can't. I got with. I've got Wigan to Prem. Season four will be mad. I'll see you with the next transfer. Rian Brewster has just joined the team for eleven point eight million pounds. I've still got thirty plus million to spend on a defender and a new goalkeeper, and just to bring some youngsters in. So I'm gonna do exactly that. Eric Garcia is finally here. Eleven million pounds. For a 21 year old 75 overall defender, and we'll put him ahead of keeper in the squad. You know, I'll see you on my next transfer. Uh, backup goalkeeper is now here, Morick from Manchester City. Hopefully, we don't get two injuries on both our goalkeepers since I think Marshall retired or something like that, or I forgot to give him a new contract. But anyway, this is good. 7.2 million pounds for a 24 year old improvement for Josh Windass in the centre attacking midfield role. I think this squad's gonna be avoiding relegation this season. It's mid season Man City, Chelsea, Liverpool, Man U, and Arsenal are in top 5. Newcastle, 6th. Everton, 7th. Uh, Whereabouts are we? Oh, we're 17th, with four points clear of relegation. Norwich, West Brom and Stoke. Uh, Liverpool, City, Man U, Chelsea and Arsenal were in the top five. So it pretty much stayed the same. Newcastle dropped to seventh. Bournemouth, sixth. I'm still mad, just that has to be a good sign. We're 15th, right, that's good. Who got relegated? Stoke and West Brom came up last season and went straight back down. Norwich finished 20th so that's uh... at the start of season 5 I've been given no minutes I've been selling players just to get a new goalkeeper I saw, I saw Murek from who I bought last season from Man City anyway welcome this legendary goalkeeper from Dortmund 32 million Liverpool, Man City, Chelsea and Man United and Arsenal are in the top 5, we are 9th on 26 points, so that ain't bad. Crystal Palace, Sheffield United and Burley are the three teams in relegation currently. I mean like, 7th in the table of the squad I've got and he's the new left midfielder for next season. But City won it, I'll give him congrats. What teams have been relegated? Sheffield United, Spurs and Burnley. I Spurs got relegated. Oh, that's weird. Uh, Liverpool won the uh, Emirates FA Cup. I don't know what we're going from ahead then. Uh, Man City won the Carabao Cup over Manchester United. So that's Manchester. Uh, Man City won Super Cups. So that's three cup. Wait, they've done treble. Barcelona beat. And uh, Barcelona lose to Atletico Madrid in the final of the Champions League. Bayern Munich. When the Euro play man just woke up. Welcome. Twenty three point five million pounds on Moses de Gempo. Anyway, that's pretty much all the money I had, so I just went all oh, since I lost my left midfielder last season. Let's go. Mid season's looking pretty damn good for us. Eighteen games in. Thirty seven points, we're placed at sixth. Liverpool top of the league. Crystal Palace, Brentford and Brighton are in Relgate. Get in. Fifth place. Man U won. The title Arsenal second. Man City fourth. Liverpool fourth. Uh, Man City third. Liverpool fourth. We finished fifth. Head of Chelsea. Brighton, Crystal Palace and Brentford have been relegated down to the championship. Spurs might come back up but we don't know. Uh, Arsenal lost 2-1 to Man U in the FA Cup final. So I'm just going to reload real quick. 
the Carabao Cup winners were Man City. Real Betis won. Uh, the Super Cup winners were Atletico Madrid over Bayern Munich. Atletico Madrid have done back to back, to back Champions Leagues. I don't think that's ever been done before. Uh, Bayern Leverkusen beat Milan for three penalties. Season 7 here I come. Season 7 of the Wigan Athletic Criminal Does It and 40 million for Zagardu from Watford who I did sign him up for Criminal but Watford also signed him without me being the manager. Let's get into the next transfer. 26 million for Emily Smith Rowe from Arsenal, 82 8 overall. Uh, 25 years old, he's going to be a very good player for our attack. So let's just get straight into the season. Mid season, we are second. Five points clear of third, Liverpool. We have only lost two games, our defence is amazing. Man City may be topping it. Sheffield United, West Brom, and four more in relegation zone. What a season this has been. First is Man United, second Liverpool, third Man City, fourth is us, Wigan Athletic. Two points clear, uh, Sheffield United, West Ham and Fulham get relegated to Stoke City, surviving by four points. So congrats to Stoke. Man City got demolished by Chelsea 5-0 in the Emirates FA Cup final. Uh, we lost 4 3 in penalties to Manchester United and we won the International Cup 2 1 against Villarreal. Uh, Atletico Madrid got, a no got the Super Cup back to back. Liverpool beat Real Madrid to win another Champions League for themselves. Oh shit, we won the fucking Europa League. Let's go. Alright, Champions League and a lot of money for next season. First transfer season A or season I don't know what season it is. Um Wigan Athletic 38.2 million for an extra pair of hands. So 22 year old 85 over I will be taking that. Quite possibly the best left midfielder I'll have this entire career mode. Anyway, if I can win the Champions League this season or my first season there, I will take it. This man will be getting us a lot of assists. 2.85 million pounds for an 85 year old, 24 year old midfielder. I am obviously going to pay that all day, every day. So, welcome, Curtis Jones, to the team Liverpool bargain. Get in. Three points behind Man City. But we are just behind the goal difference against Liverpool. Uh, we're third. Brentford, Stoke, and Burnley are in relegation. A backup strike of. I mean, I already have a backup, but he's probably going to leave during this transfer window. Or if I don't win the Champions League this season, next season, he's so unhappy with the club. So I brought this guy in. The first leg of the Champions League round of 16s is here. Can we win away from home? Because that would be amazing for us. Can we or not? 2-2 two -two draw, I shall be taking that. Second leg is at our ground. Can we win? Hopefully. Because we need a win or just a 0-0 no -no draw. 1-1. One -one. Will we? Who knows? 1-1. One -one. That does send us through to the quarters. First leg of the quarterfinals. It's 2027. It's taken me seven... Well, eight seasons. This is my eighth season of this. First season Champions League. I really want to win it. It's been a very long journey. 2-2 Two -two draw. That's good. Keep it on the high ground. Here we go. Second leg. What can we do? We'll win. We'll, we'll lose. Hopefully we can get through to the semis. And Pedro the new Ellen that I bought. What a guy. 100th. The first leg against Borussia Dortmund is away. Again, we'll keep on getting away games in these knockout stages. Oh well. At least we have a chance of going through to the final. 2 no win. Let's go lads. The second leg is what determines if we go through. If we lose 2-0, we are... It just go takes for time. If we, if we lose 1-0, no, we're fine. No, no, draw. Even better. Come on. We go up against Manchester City. 
for the Champions League Final Cup. Oh, this is so goddamn important for, for this club. First ever Champions League, I'm going to do whatever I can to win it. In a way, Bayern Leverkusen beat Milan for the Europa League uh, trophy. We won the Premier League. Man City, Man U and Liverpool are also got Champions League. Uh, the, F the FA Cup were won by City. We lost 2-0 to Arsenal in Carabao Cup Final and into Milan. Uh, and then we lost 2-1 to Liverpool in the FA in the Super Cup. I'm going straight into the City game. It's going to be a banger. You don't want to miss it. Get in there. Come on. Why I have move control connected? I'll change that in a minute. Williams. We're on the attack. Oh, what a save from Edison. Um, also, I'm not going to be starting part of the start, part of the end, just so I can fit the trophy for celebration in. But, yeah, uh, they're, they are playing some alright football. Oh god, they've got an attack. Come on, goalkeeper, please save this. If they, right, good defending from us. I think that's Williams, number 20. See what we could do to defend them. Well, cost difficulty. Oh god, this is bad. This is so bad for Rose. I just had to pass it out and try and get as far up as I could. If we do fall one 0 behind us, so it's not going to be too good. Come, save it. Oh god, a goalkeeper probably could save that as well. That's just a bit that annoys me about that. Not good enough. Not good enough. Shit. I'm I'm needing a win from these lads as well. That's something else. Come on. Use your skill. Alright. Take a shot. Brewster! Well go. They'll go Ryan Bruce still with a goal. Well, it's the sort of determination and desire. Oh, All the momentum is with them now. Well, they say you're at your most vulnerable when you've scored a goal, and that's the case today. They'll be really disappointed to give away that goal. The manager won't Their be happy to. defense just did not do their job, though. So, who's at blame? Really on their side, I wonder. Uh -huh. That's just all them being the ton of bold jobbing. Yeah. Someone's retiring. In fact, someone retiring for us, it doesn't matter. Because we are going to win this, and I know we will. But I put my faith in the squad, and what a save. Alright, can we get a second? Green Bruce on the attack. It, this has been his game so far. Alright. Oh my god, we just chipped him. I didn't think that was going to work. I just did it, because why not? And then, yeah. They are just shit. This is just all you have to do to Edison in real life, though. It ain't good. Oh, if Shea Adams can score from the halfway line in real life, what is the older version of him going to do? I knew that if they were going to have Edison in there, he'd be bad. But yeah. They're on the attack again. Can we break it up? Come on, defence. Alright, they're just passing out. Not looking good for us. Get rid of it, well gone. Oh no, is he going to take his shot? What's happened? Oh, he took the shot. A goalkeeper had that covered though, luckily. That was just bad. Luckily, he recovered it, but that could have ended way worse. Wow. Defend it. Come on. Come on. Oh, he can't even get past his first man. Shit. 
This ain't looking good at all. No, 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 no. Oh, this is looking bad. Come on, defend better, lads. Right, get rid of it. Oh my god. I tried to pass it over to Robertson. Or oh, Robinson, whatever he's called. It just ended like that for us. Fair play to their finishing. 2 2. It's not looking too good. We need a third, but I'd like a fourth to really just secure this. But if we do fall one, another goal behind, it's going to be a lot harder for us to get back. Their fans are fucking eager. Just because they scored like, yes, we're going to win, yeah. We're the madder. Oh, that was bad from Brewster. I thought he would actually be able to get that through. Oh, that was bad from uh, Smith Row. Alright, come on, Williams. Williams has been working hard. Alright, Oterine Brewster, attack your. Oh, you can't attack his space. Fudge. Oh no. Oh no. Don't let him get back though, though. Defended it. it was a risky challenge, but there we really go. Alright. Come. Right. Try and get Brewster in the goal. Come on. Over to Brewster. Over to Brewster. Oh, oh my god. Goal. Champion. Champion. There we go. One win right there for us. That is a good, it's just a good, good game right now. I did not think that would happen at all. Wow. Right, they're playing some fabulous football. Don't let them attack us. We're getting so desperate right now. Defend it. Defend it. Come on, pass it out. Bad pass. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's still 3 2. Oh. Who the hell was that? We ain't looking too good right now, let me just say that. We ain't looking good at all. Pass it out. Alright, there we go. Pass it back out. Alright, I'm gonna just bring it in. Get your head. Not good enough. Alright, oh that was a bad header, but can you get it, Brewster? Oh, he nearly lost his fucking eye. Surely this ref has to get some sympathy towards us there. But this ref just ain't doing that good. Right, they need to do a, they need to stoke seals. Right, sliding, there we go. I'll take a yellow card for that, to be honest. Only a yellow. Do we taking them? Let's just get this out. To our fullback? No. Right, come defend that, yo. There we go. Sterling. Alright. I'm going to try and pronounce the first bit of Samuel's name. Alright. Into Brewster. Oh, that hit crossbar. Ah, oh, it's not looking good. This team's getting very desperate. To be honest, this would be 4 or 5 to up, to be honest. But our goalkeeper has done a couple of mistakes like really shouldn't be happening on a, a goalkeeper of this level but what can I do? Alright, come on defend. Alright, pass it out to Brewster. Alright, oh, he doesn't have his strength fighting needs. Pretty damn weak. Alright, they're just good carrying an attack at us and 
well he's going to have to carry on defending defend that there we go there we go right we're hitting them on count right now ball poor from Emily Smith Rowe perfect opportunity just can't execute out right come on back on the attack come on in right Brewster can you get a fourth oh, he's got a fourth I can't believe it all goals to that man in the Champions League final that's mad how often does that happen in real life I'm saying it doesn't happen often enough Trying to win the ball back, lads. Oh, we're getting close. Just not close enough. Don't let them get a third. Just don't. Good defending from us there. Alright. There we go. Cross it in. Good corner. Oh, bad weather. <laughs> Perfect cross as well. <sighs> Just not good enough from us. Not good enough. This is looking bad. Oh no. Don't let them get a goal, come on. Don't open your mouth, yeah? Just don't let, just never ever open your mouth and say that they won't score. It's Man City. They will score if you say that. They'll put the doubters to bed, like we always do. Who oh, no. Who oh, no. It's not looking good. It's looking like, it's looking piss poor. Oh no. Look at that skill right there to just do that. Oh my god. Right, that's it's consolation goal, but still. Because I'm just going to keep all the ball. What a shot. I go keep probably could have saved that as well. It, it's just his reflexes weren't good enough in the end. But he put his... I don't know what to think of that. Anyway, like, subscribe, peace out for now. Peace. Enjoy his trophy. Well, you just think how many games they've played this season as well. All that's in the past now. The game that's just happened was the most important one they're all poised the Champions League winners and you can feel the emotion it's natural to reflect on this final but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign Memories, memories. The cup with the big ears, as it's affectionately known. And this is the moment, Derek, sharing it with the supporters. You get a chance to take it a little bit closer to those stands. Let them enjoy the experience with you. And the families are up there in the stands as well. A brilliant occasion. It's a fire as well as ice on the pitch. Necessary qualities. Well, they've come together in this competition as a team and they're celebrating together now. Fully deserved. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.